Hello, I'm Tenran432, and today I'm going to be playing Mega Man Zero Two uh, because I haven't uploaded anything in three months. Um, I said I would be playing Super Mario World or Chrono Trigger, but I really don't want to yet, so I'm just gonna play Mega Man Zero Two. Continue with that and uh, new game right about now. So, if you remember, um, it's been like a hundred years since the X Mega Man X games took place, and now it's a whole year later, and uh, Zero's still alive, walking around. He was like resurrected by a cyber elf, which are sentient beings, well, computers, I guess. But uh, he's just been... he joined the resistance, took out uh, an evil copy X, and um... The resistance got away. One and uh, since then, Zero has been walking around in the desert by himself, uh, fighting Neo Arcadia. Cue the great Mega Man music. And Zero's back with his nice long hair. And, um, then we're gonna take on some, some, uh, weird, not Mega Man X's, because they are blue with guns on their arm. But anyway, I just have to change my attack mode, and then, um, I guess we can just start slicing at these guys forever. Or maybe not. Maybe this isn't fun anymore, like Zero said. Maybe we can continue on with the level, so I can show you how to do this. So, the rules are the same as the last game, pretty much. And, uh, just, uh, just a normal intro level, pretty easy. Just jump around avoiding those things. Slice open those. They, uh, fall over. Don't fall in there. And, uh, yeah, there's not really much to do at this level. Except these mini bosses. You just have to shoot them in the head, and um, when when the lasers to the left fire, uh, you're going to want to go to the back of the screen. And when the lasers on the right fire, you're going to want to go as close to the um, machine as you can. They're called golems. I don't know if anyone can for that. Um, so the second golem. Um, it's a little bit harder, because you might fall off that ledge. Just keep dodging. Same strategy, just don't fall off the ledge. And there you go. Easy as apple cake. Just, um, we already got some cyber elves, and as you can see it shows you the name of the cyber elf. Uh, so that's pretty cool. The only thing I don't like about it is that it takes up so much of the screen. But I don't really have much other to say than that, so I guess I'll just be silent until the end of the level. Anyway, now we run into more not Mega Mans, and we totally can't slash through them like earlier because. Well, Zero wouldn't think it would be fun, and we already have the job taken care of for us by Giant Crab Arm. And yep, that's the uh, boss for this level. It's a giant scorpion, I believe. It only has three main attacks, it'll use its tail to do what it just did. Um, break the ground. It'll use its other arm to shield shield itself. Um, it'll throw its arm at you, and then the arm will just kind of come back. And that's pretty much all of its attacks, I think. Anyway, pretty simple, because it's just the um, first stage of the game. Oh, it can also shoot pellets from there. That's it. 
so we already got it, so it doesn't really matter. And there we go, that's the first level. Oh, break time. Level A. Alright, I guess I did good. Somehow, I... I did it, but it... It cost me everything. Blah. Blah. Mega Man Zero game, so that's not possible. Anyway, back at New Resistance Base. Ladies and gentlemen, thanks to your great efforts, it gives me great pleasure to announce the completion of this New Resistance Base. I thank you all for accepting me as the commander of this new base. I promise to bring about a new era of peace. That's what they all say. <laughs> I'm still a little embarrassed when I think about being a commander. Are you sure about this? Trusting our fate to a reploid like me? Absolutely. It was you who organized us to fight against Neo Arcadia when we were barely able to escape from there. I'm flattered. But you helped me all along. You know how unreliable I am without you, Seal. You just keep in mind that we had to organize a resistance force in order to defend ourselves. Yes, I will remember that. And now we are buying time for you to complete your research. Still, since X has not been resurrected yet, we couldn't ask for a better opportunity than now. Please, allow me to carry out my operation. Alright. But promise me one thing. Do not be too strict. You have my... Excuse me, sir. It's about Zero. He was found lying unconscious. Just outside the base. What? Zero? This way. Zero! Zero! Zero. Meanwhile, in the maintenance room... Zero! I'm glad you're alive, Zero. Zero, you're functional again. You're in rough shape. I'm amazed you're still alive. Welcome back. Where am I? You're in the new Resistance base. Thanks to you, we were able to escape from Neo Arcadia and start a new life in this place. Thank you so much. And I'm sorry that we were unable to come rescue you. Come on, Seal. Zero must be very tired. I think. I know you have lots to discuss with him, but why don't we let him rest for a bit? And Zero, I'm afraid that most of your weapons were broken. Therefore, I've fixed them. Also, I, I created a new weapon, so why don't you come by later to pick it up? 
Okay, I'll go... I'll go here. I'll be in my lab for a while. Come talk to me when you're feeling better. Alright then, we are perfectly fine now, after all that. And, uh, we can jump off walls as if, um... We're an animal that can jump off walls really high. You've recovered, Zero. You're known by all of our resistance soldiers, Zero. Well, except for the new, really new members who have just arrived here recently. If you wanna... Oh well, I was scrolling too fast. It just said if you wanna talk to people, hit the up button, and that uh, Seal and Cerevu are looking for us. So let's go through command room to get to their room. Hello. My name is El Paizo. I have been appointed as commander of this new resistance base. I've heard a lot about you. Please lend your support to us. Let's fight together and destroy Neo Arcadia. Hendrick. Destroy Neo Arcadia, huh? It's not that easy. Then what are you gonna do? I don't know. <laughs> you are a very funny reploid. Anyway, nice to meet you, Mr. Legend. At this point in time, I was having a little bit of um, a tough time holding my controller properly. That's why I was moving in weird directions. But anyway, to the lab. Here's Cerevu. Cerevu. Or Cerevu. Honestly, how can you wear out your weapons like that? But don't worry, I fixed them. I even created a new weapon called the Chain Rod for you. It's an outstanding weapon. Want instructions? Nope, I already know how to use it. Yeah, um, I actually, um, before today, or before I started this playthrough, I had almost no experience with Mega Man Zero Two, and I had no idea how to use the chain rod. So, uh, but I figured it out within the next day. But anyway, I'm going to, uh, for some reason, I forgot that I was supposed to talk to Seal until it was too late and started swinging around for like 20 seconds. So now we'll, uh, I'll have to edit this video with my editing There you go, saved 35 seconds of your life using editing. Zero, are you okay? Uh-huh. That's good. I was so worried about you. We've been trying so hard to find you. I'm glad you found us. I found you? I came here before I lost consciousness? Da da da. Do you remember what I'm working on? I'm conducting research that will de help develop a subsequent energy for energy crystals. Okay, you know what? This is really hard to say. So I'm just gonna, um summarize it. She basically says she's working on an alternate energy source for Neo Arcadia because they Neo Arcadia is lacking energy and that's what caused this whole conflict uh, between these humans and reploids in this era. So that's what she's working on and hopefully when she makes the energy source there will be no more conflict. When I told this story to Commander El Paizo, he laughed at it. He does say he will wait until I succeed in developing a subsequent energy, but in truth, El Paizo believes defeating Neo Arcadia is the only way to regain peace. I have to finish this. I'll bring order to the world, not with destruction, but by the power of science. My research is almost done. I still need a little more information, though. Anyway, I'm going to manage your data for you if you need me. Come and talk to me anytime, okay? Save data now, yeah. Save data one. And that's about 15 minutes, so that's all the time I have for today. So, uh, peace and sheep. I'll just uh, let Zero swing around for a little bit. And, uh, yeah, see you in the next part.